Welcome to Tennis Spin, where we put our spin on your tennis. Question from Victor here. Having a little shoulder problems. Possibly racket change? I don't know. We'll, we'll see. Stay tuned. All right, so, hi, my name is Victor. I'm 19 years old, and actually I'm playing at the university. I'm writing to you because I'm having some problems with my tennis racket, specifically shoulder problems, and I think that I should change my racket. Nowadays, I'm playing with a Wilson Blade 98 Lite. So what tennis racket do you re recommend to me? My height is... 170 centimeters, which is 5.58 feet. My weight is 65 kilograms, right-handed, aggressive player with very, with topspin back forehand and flat backhand. Good and fast uh, serve. I'm fast, but not a good finisher. I don't like going into the court to the net. Uh, Okay. All right, Victor. So a couple things here. Um, we need to get you out of that 98 light. Uh, we should probably get you in a regular blade 98. So the standard weighting will definitely help your shoulder and your arm because the extra weight will help um, dampen things. If you decide to keep and you love that 98 light though, uh, you're going to have to load it up with a good amount of lead. Uh, that 98 light, I believe, is about 10.1 ounces. You need to get that thing up to um, 10.8 or close to 11 ounces. And most of that weight is going to go underneath this grip inside the handle or inside that butt cap because uh, your light is actually pretty head heavy. So if you decide to keep that racket, load up the handle with strips of lead and then re-counterbalance with some um, lead at 3 and 9 and possibly 12. And that should help your shoulder. Um, maybe, depending on where it hurts in your shoulder, my guess is, and this is only a guess, is your racket's too light for you, like I'm saying, uh, change to a standard. Um, if your shoulder hurts in front here, right here, that's a forehand problem. You're hitting late. If it hurts out here, that is kind of a rotator cuff problem. You should um, probably grip it a little looser, possibly warm up a little bit. Um, definitely extra weight on your racket will help. If it's back here, it has something to do with your backhand. So uh, it, you're striking it late on that backhand. So depending on where it hurts on your shoulder, um, will it will depend on uh, what what stroke is affecting you. So, but I would definitely start by going extra weight on your racket or buying a new blade that's a standard version. Um, as I tell everybody, you know, don't grip it tight. Get that racket out in front of you and make sure you hit out in front. Uh, then stuff don't won't hurt as much. Um, depending on your string setup, possibly go a little looser. Uh, 48 pounds, 50 pounds, 52 pounds probably uh, would be the max I would go if you're having shoulder problems. Uh, but definitely make sure your strokes are out in front of you. If you're in college, you probably have decent strokes already. So just minor tweaks. Uh, definitely equipment change uh, will do you good, okay? Um, but try that out and, and see if, uh, if that helps solve uh, your shoulder problems. Um, if you have a Theragun or if you have access to a Theragun, hit, hit the shoulder up with the Theragun um, after you play just to you know, get rid of the, uh, the buildup of the scar tissue, okay? So try those things. And let me know um, what happens. Thank you for watching Tennis Spin, where we put our spin on your tennis.